Alrighty guys, so today we're looking at the Real Ice mod and the Proper Length Arrows mod. They're really two small mods that don't really change your game too much, they just change the overall appearance of the look. So I decided to make two mods in the one video, not to spam you guys with videos, etc. And so right now I'm just showing you up north uh, of Skyrim the all the ice. As you can see there's a crap load of ice all along up here, up north. And oh, where are we? Is this Septimus Cygnus's outpost that's where we are and as you can see this is just the vanilla ice and in this mod that I'm going to be showing you it is it updates the ice so it looks a lot better and also it, there's different types of ice so I think there's a black ice uh, for the moment and there's I think an even wider type of ice or something like that but the guy is continually updating it so it does look continually better and better but we'll be right back with the actual mod installed and obviously there'll be pictures as well because the guy took some really good quality pictures to compare all the different types of ice but we'll be back alrighty guys and now here we are with the actual mod installed as you can see actually I just gotta put the TGM on there we go we got mode enabled so I should be able to run there we go alright so as you can see the ice definitely looks a lot lot better uh, it really does reflect off the sun which is actually like obviously how uh, ice is supposed to be well, as we just fall into the water the ice looks really amazing the now because of the um, flames as well the reflects it really nicely so it does look really good actually let's go, let's go TCM so we can no TFC there we go silly me so now we can oh, let's go up so we can actually look at all the ice craters and things like that ice glaciers I guess I should call it I think it changes even like it changes definitely it does change all these little breakaway little ice things as well they look really really shiny so hopefully you guys will actually enjoy this it definitely does make a rather large difference and there are different types of uh, ice you can download as well so obviously this type of ice snow ice not the other type of ice but uh, there'll be pictures after this anyway so hopefully you guys will enjoy and next up will be a uh, weapon type mod so Come back for that. Alrighty, so now we're looking at the proper length arrows mod. And this is just a really, really simple uh, weapon fix, a uh, graphical type fix. So as you can see, when I draw my arrow, the arrow rests on my hand, which really isn't that realistic because you don't want a sliced up hand. Even though my guy is obviously carrying armor and stuff, you, you still don't want a whole sliced up hand when you're shooting arrows. And also what he does change as well is, uh, the guy that made the mod, is when uh, you have larger arrows, so I think they're the Dorga uh, arrows, and the, I can't remember the, the actual type of arrows, but uh, there's a certain type of arrow that are really, really long, so he uh, updated the quivers, so the, uh, the quiver length, so they look more realistic. So it's a, a really simple mod, so have a look one more time at where the um, hand rests, and then we'll be right back with the actual mod. Alrighty, so now we have the mod installed, and hopefully you guys will, will, will be able to see uh, that the arrowhead now obviously doesn't rest on your guy's hand, so you're not going to be obviously cut up if this was real life or anything like that obviously I have that ice mod still installed and so it's a little bit further away and hopefully you guys enjoyed this mod this mod's actually picked up a lot lately so that's why I'm doing it even though it doesn't really change too much it's just a really simple aesthetic change as you can see I've failed a couple of arrow shots but anyway thanks for watching guys and make sure you come back for more